Hi Libra, how you doing? Let's see what messages we have for you concerning your love life. This time round, what messages do we have please for the sign of Libra concerning love? Messages for all oh, Libra concerning love. Well, three cards flipped. I'll put them back. There's progression here and an emotional response. I feel somebody's going to open up their emotions. Let's see. Libra. What have we in store for you concerning love? Nine of Cups. Are you wishing on something, Libra? There's some emotion, a lot of emotions here. Happiness. Wow, communication, eight of wands. Mm. Feel the pace of your life is about to go up a notch. Three of Swords. There's a certain amount of heartache here. For some of you, somebody around you could be recovering from an illness. Page of Cups. Messages. A small expression, a small token of love. That's what I'm getting from that. Love connection here. It's a strong connection. Spiritually. Mm. Five of Pentacles. Some sorrow here. I feel you're going to leave somebody standing in the cold. Six of Pentacles. I'm getting split loyalties here. It's a heavy load you're carrying, an emotional load you're carrying because I feel there's more than one person after your attention. <laughs> Six of Cups, person from the past. Nine of Wands. I feel you're like between two worlds, between stuck in the middle between two situations with two different people. And it's causing some stress. It is. It's causing some stress. Mm, there's that old drama card. Committal energy though. Knight of Swords. This is, I feel something. I feel you could get a message out of the blue. Totally unexpected. You're there kind of sitting pretty and then all of a sudden comes fast communication out of nowhere. And in a sense, it will give you a feeling of self-satisfaction, but at the same time, it will cause this because I feel it will stir up some emotions that's been, that you feel you put to rest a long time ago and it's, it's awakened you and... You're kind of thinking about two different situations here. I'm getting the feeling of isolation here. Somebody wants to try a game with you, a person from your past. Yeah, <laughs> could well be an invite here. You're feeling flat. I'm getting flattered. Feeling flattered. Somebody's trying to flatter you. Aries Leo Sag energy, fire energy, or somebody with a passion, adventurous, somebody who's kind of a bit flighty, in and out, a bit like a jumping jack. But there could be a well, an invitation here to travel, or they come and see you. Hmm. Interesting, four pentacles. I feel you're resisting this somehow. 
you're feeling flattered, but mm, there's, I feel there's, there's a kind of a driving force here, but there's some resistance. Take this out, resonates. This could be you, could be them, but there's some resistance here. Mm, a little bit of confusion. I feel here, be careful of misunderstandings. I'm getting communicate clear here. Communicate clearly. Yeah. This this person from the past could well contact you and say, you know, I'm f I'm finished with my present partner. I'm sorry. I feel this message could put you in a dilemma and kind of put your back up the wall. Not get your back up as in make you angry. I'm kind of I'm kind of getting it all sort of put you into a metaphorical corner where a decision must be made. Yeah. I feel here you are giving your love life some serious consideration here. Four of Cups. And I am getting at the moment, you know, you're kind of sitting on the fence. Probably probably thinking, well, it's better not to act very quickly. We'll see how it develops that kind of energy. Sometimes in our life, if we're not very, very sure of a situation or not sure of where it's leading, sometimes it is better to just sit on the fence and wait for a little while at least. So you've got two fours here. Two fours, stability, trying to remain stable, but also two fours is eight, and eight in the major arcana is strength. So this resistance... You are resisting the urge to just rush in. It's what I'm getting for a lot of you. I say this won't resonate with all of you, but hmm, I don't know your your exact situation because it's a general read. So you know, it's take it out it resonates. Yeah, near future you will disconnect. I feel you'll make a decision. And just walk away. I'm getting this could go either way for you. Yeah. Split loyalties. I feel you're trying to keep the peace with everybody. <laughs> with this king of wands. It's more wand energy. There's a lot of activity here. There's a lot of wand energy. Five of wands, nine of wands, knight of wands, eight of wands, and now the king of wands. There's a lot of activity. And I feel it all centers around you, trying to kind of keep a peaceful resolution with both parties. Hmm. Yeah. Yeah, they're unbalanced. I don't mean mentally. I mean they're unbalanced emotionally. You know, their life's quite hectic. And as I say, they are like a jumping jack. One minute they want one thing and another. Another day they want another. You know, they kind of... They kind of got like going through conflicting emotions at the moment. But one thing's for sure, they want to try again with you. Yeah. Oh dear. 
two nines, dilemma, trepidation, resistance, sleepless nights, two nines, 18, the moon, confusion, a little bit of fear, You know, I'm kind of getting a reluctance to face up to reality here. And as I say, this could be you, could be them. And, you know, trying to back off, trying to please everybody, trying to keep the peace, trying to remain neutral. But I feel what what's going to happen here for a lot of you is that you will sooner or later realise that you've got to make a decision one way or the other. This nine, ten, as I say, kind of like being backed into a corner, metaphorically. Yeah. Be careful of a rash decision here. Somebody here, you know, who's very stable. It's earth energy. Stable stability and security, that's what I'm getting from this. But they have a there's a feeling to I get the feeling that there's a rushed deal here. And I mean that metaphorically. They want it done and dusted very quickly, safe and secure, signed on the dotted line. At the bottom of the deck, you see, you've got the tower. I hope that's helped you in some way, and I hope to see you again very, very soon. I'm going to conclude it there. It's. I feel here there's a very, very big choice for you, a personal choice. Uh, this decision will have far-reaching consequences into the future. We'll see you soon. Bye for now.